Welcome to SEPAM, Super Easy Physics and Maths. Today we are going to look at the solution to lower secondary checkpoint science. October 2017, Paper 2. Question 1. Angeli and her friend are planning a party. They want to prepare food that will be part of a healthy, balanced diet. They find this information on the internet. Look at the different class of food in the different layer of this food pyramid. The below you have carbohydrate like cereal corn bread next ones are vitamin you have vegetables and fruits food that need to be eaten moderately you have protein you have milk you have egg you have chicken and uh, cheese then eat food that you need to eat less of fat and oil as in case of oil and uh, so from this table let's see the question the information state that a person should eat mostly cereals and whole grain which group of nutrients is provided by cereals and whole grain? Energy given food that is carbohydrate, carbohydrate, fiber, or starch. Any of them can serve as the answer. Why do we need this food nutrient? Carbohydrate give energy. Fiber prevent constipation. People advise to eat more fruit and vegetable in their diet. This helps to prevent them from developing deficiency disease such as scurvy and rickets. Rickets, lack of vitamin D, scurvy, lack of vitamin C. Name the group of nutrients which help to prevent this deficiency disease. Vitamins. Eating too much fat and oil can lead to health problem. State one harmful result of eating too much fat and oil. Heart disease, obesity, high blood pressure, diabetes, stroke, high cholesterol, plague in blood vessels, Question 2. This question is about the state of matter. Complete this sentence about the state of matter. Select words from this list. The particles in solid are closely passed together, which means solid cannot be squashed. When a solid evaporates, the particles separate when a solid change into liquid it is said to melt the particle of a gas fill any container in which they are placed explain why there's weak intermolecular force between particles of gas particles of gas are far apart free to move to quickly move in all direction from each other to fill the container question three may i place her fruit her flute the oscilloscope shows the sound the flute makes here is an oscilloscope picture 
there are two complete waves in this picture. This wave have a frequency of two units. The frequency of the wave increases to six units. The amplitude stays the same. What is the number of complete waves that are now seen in the oscilloscope picture? So if you look at this, one complete circle, that is that, that is one circle. Then the second complete circle, that is two units. The number of complete circle in a second, that is equal to the frequency of the wave. So the frequency of this wave in the oscilloscope was two units. So the frequency of the wave is two hertz. Then if the frequency increases to six units, so the frequency is now six hertz. What is the number of complete circle? The number of complete circle made in a second is the frequency. So when the frequency is six, that means there are six complete wave in one second. What happened to the height of the wave on the oscilloscope picture? This one shows the picture of com six complete wave. What happened to the height of the wave? The height of the wave remains the same. The height of the wave is what we refer to as the amplitude and it's three units. The height stays the same, 3 cm. So let's just look at the amplitude of a wave affects the loudness of the wave. That is a loud wave, a loud sound has high amplitude why a soft sound has low amplitude why the pitch of a sound is affected by the frequency of the sound the higher the amplitude the louder the sound the lower the amplitude more quiet the sound may I move further away from the microscope may I move further away from the microphone she plays the flute in exactly the same way. Explain what, hap explain what happens to the oscilloscope picture. The frequency remains the same, but the amplitude or the height reduces. The wavelength of the wave remains constant. Question 4. There are still many undiscovered species of animals and plants in remote parts of the world. The diagram shows a newly discovered species which scientists have classified and named. Name the class of vertebrates that include isotris. Circle the correct answer. He has a fissure of a mammal. Give two reasons for your answer. It has hairs or fur covering the body. It has a stunner ears. Question 5. Hassan is a farmer. The soil on his field is too acidic to grow some crop. As I want to find out the pH of the sun, he uses litmus. How does litmus turn tells Asan that the soil is acidic? Acidic soil turns blue litmus paper to red. Why an alkaline soil turns red litmus paper to blue? Hassan's friend suggests that he uses universal indicator instead of litmus. Explain why. Universal indicator changes color and show the pH value of a substance. So different color tell you the acidity of the soil. But litmus paper just change to blue and it does not tell you the level of acidity of the soil. So that is the advantage of universal indicator over 
blue litmus paper. So let's take a closer look at the universal indicator and the colors change that take place as the acidity of the soil varies. So this is the example of a universal indicator colors. Red, yellow, green, blue, and purple. If the pH of the soil is between 0 and 2, and if the soil is strongly acidic, the color will be red. And then, as the pH increases, so between 3 and 4, that's to tell you that the soil is weakly acidic. Then, the pH value of 7, the universal indicator will give you a green color to tell you that the soil is neutral, it's neither acidic nor alkaline. Then if the universal indicator changes to blue, that will tell you that the soil is weakly alkaline. But if the indicate, universal indicator shows purple color, that means the soil is strongly alkaline. Question B. Asan add an alkaline to the field. The acid in the soil reacts with the alkaline. What is the name of this type of reaction? The reaction between acid and alkaline to give you salt and water is called neutralization reaction. Acid plus alkaline to give you salt and water is neutralization reaction. Question 6. Look at the picture of the star seen from the same position on the surface of the earth. One of the pictures is from June and the other one is from December. Why are the pattern of the star different? The Earth is rotating on its axis and revolving around the Sun. Simply put, the Earth is moving. A picture of star is taken in October. It's taken from the same position on the Earth. What pattern will the star have in the month of October? is going to have different pattern because the position of the earth is different in October compared to June and December. Question 7. Rajiv and Jamila investigate photosynthesis. They set up the apparatus as shown. So this photosynthesis, you put a pond weed inside the the petri dish, and they're using a funnel and uh, your 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 tube your gas tube your heating tube over it so they want to find out how changing the distance of the lamp from the water plant affect the rate of photosynthesis write down two variable that they measure time taken to shine the light the number of bubble or the volume of oxygen gas produced. The distance of the lamp from the water plant. Raji and Jamila do their experiment. Here is their result the number of bubble produced 
as a function of the distance of the land from the water plant in CM. Describe the pattern. You see, as the distance, the number of bubble, as the distance increases, when it was, when the distance was 10 cm, it produced 30 bubble. When the distance was 20, it produces 25 bubbles. When the distance was 30, it produces uh, less than 20. That is close to 20. That is about uh, uh, 18 bubbles. And then when the distance was 40 cm away, it reduced to 9 bubbles. So what do you say here? As the distance increases, the numbers of bubbles produced reduces. Okay. The further the lamp is from the water plant, the fewer the bubbles of gas produce. Question 8. Sophia and Carlos do some displacement reaction. The sentence are in wrong order. Complete the box to show the correct order. They place different matter into five test tube. They add copper nitrate solution to each test tube. They look to see if there is reaction. They repeat the method with different solution. The table shows their results. A tick shows a reaction take place and a cross shows that there is no reaction. So which one is more reactive? Magnesium reacted with zinc nitrate, iron nitrate, and uh, lead nitrate. So the most reactive element here is magnesium. Then the second one is zinc, which zinc reacts with iron and lead nitrate. So that is the second most reactive zinc. Then the third is lead oh, sorry that is iron then the last but not the least is lead which does not react with any of the nitrates so that is the least reactive there complete the word equation for the reaction between zinc and lead nitrate zinc and lead nitrate zinc is higher than lead so zinc is going to displace lead from nitrate to form zinc nitrate and lead will be deposited so zinc displaces lead from lead nitrate solution to form zinc nitrate solution and lead precipitate so that is the word equation Jamila and Ahmed collect information about camel and horse. Camel, the weight of camel is 5,000 newton, total area of the feet, 2,000 cm square. The weight of a horse, 4,000 newton, total area of feet, 400 cm square. So calculate the total pressure exerted by the horse feet. So use the formula for pressure force per unit area. So 4000 newton divided by 400 cm square that will give you 10 newton per cm square. So the pressure exerted by horse is higher
by the feet of a horse is higher than the pressure exerted by the feet of a camel. And that is why, because the pressure is low for camel, the camel can walk on a desert sandy soil without sinking. And you see, the feet of the camel is wider by than the feet of a horse. Question 10. Yosef investigate friction. He drop mambo into different liquid. Yosef make a prediction. I predict that the honey will make the most friction. So here is the result. Make took 2.5 seconds for the marble to drop to the bottom. Olive oil took 3.1 seconds. Honey took 3.4 seconds. And corn syrup took 3.5 seconds. So the longer the time of fall, the higher the friction, the viscosity of the liquid. Yosef, is Yosef's prediction correct? Circle the correct answer. The consider of have the most friction and the longest time of 3.5 seconds. So his prediction is not correct. Yosef want to increase the time it takes for the mambo to fall. Describe how he could increase the time it takes for the marble to fall. He can use different liquid or he can use a taller container. Use thicker liquid or change the temperature of the liquid by heating. Because the lighter the liquid, the lower the viscosity and the friction. Question 11. Mike and Oliver find information about some planets. Which two planets take more time than Earth will beat the Sun? So you can see you have Jupiter and Mars. Jupiter took 11 points. Jupiter took almost 12 years, while Mars took almost 2 years, 1.9 years. Oliver finds some information about the planets Saturn and Uranus. Mike makes the information. Mike says the information is incorrect. What is wrong with the information? Explain your answer. Saturn is closer to the sun, so we should have less time to beat the sun compared to Uranus. Question 12. Different cells have different function. Draw a line from each cell to its function. You have nerve cells, you have red blood cell, and you have sperm cells. Nerve cells transmit nerve impulse around the body. Red blood cell carry oxygen around the body. Sperm cell fertilize the egg cell. The cell that absorb water and mineral so from the ground is root hair, but it's not here. Question 13. Look at the diagram. The diagram shows the particles in five substances. The white and gray circle represent types of atom. So you look at this. 
which two diagram shows mixture mixture the one that contains two different atoms so you have a and c explain your answer different types of atom are not joined different elements are not bonded question 14 forces are useful when playing different sports drawn an arrow from the tennis ball to show the direction of gravity gravity always add downward towards the center of the earth fourteen b there are forces between the rugby ball there is a force between the rugby ball and the boy's hand write down the name of this force friction when the golf ball moves through air a force slow it down air resistant friction or drag force any of them is correct question 15 look at the diagram it shows some different variety of pigeon The four pigeons all have different color. Describe one other difference that you can see in the diagram between a wide rock dove and a fan tail pigeon. Fan tail pigeon. Fan tail has a star extra set of tail feathers the raisin pigeon a special breed for speed and stamina describe one feature of the raisin pigeon shown in the diagram that enable it to fly at high speed Streamline shape, large wind, powerful wind. Question 16. Pyria connect an electric circuit. He connects three resistors, two ohm. 3 ohm and 4 ohms in parallel to a battery and there are 5 ammeters ammeter 1, ammeter 2, ammeter 3, ammeter 4 and ammeter 5 that are connected to the circuit what happened that the current that is flowing this wire 1 is going to split into wire 2, wire 3 and wire 4 so the current in the first wire 1.8 ampere is the same current that is flowing through this wire 5 here yeah, ammeter 5 so this and this will measure the same current because it's the same wire that is a major wire connected to the battery but this current is going to divide into this current from the wire 1 we divide to flow through ammeter 2 ammeter 3 and ammeter 4 so we have current one we divide because it's a parallel circuit into current two current three and current four but take note the smaller the smaller the resistance the bigger the current so two ohm we take is align 0.8 ampere to pass through it 3 ohm is allowing 0.6 ampere to pass him 
So this 4 ohm is going to allow a lesser current to pass through it because of the higher resistance. So when we substitute the value, so we have 1.8 is equal to 0 0.6 plus 0, 0 0.8 plus I4. So if you do the mathematics, so I4 is equal to 1.8 minus 1.4 to give you 0 0.4 ampere. So that current there is 0 0.4 ampere. Why the current 5 is 1.8 ampere? Question 17. Oliver investigates which variable affects the decay of leaves. He puts some falling leaves in three different types of soil. Soil A, soil B, soil C. pH value of the soil 8, 6 and 8. Percentage of air in the soil 30, 20, 20. Percentage of water in the soil 30, 30, 30. Decomposer help to decay the leaf. Name one type of microorganism which is a decomposer. Bacteria and fungi. Any of them is correct. Oliver finds that the leaf in soy C decay faster than those in soy B. It's an alkaline soy. Soy C is an alkaline soy. The alkalinity is higher. So just why? Soy C is alkaline or soy C has a higher alkalinity, pH value. That brings us to the end of paper 2, October, Science Paper 2, October 2017. Thank you for learning.